Welcome, welcome everyone. I am Reverend Robin Richardson and you are um, with the Divine uh, Healing Service at the Cosmic Center of Spiritual Light. We have a treat for you today. Uh, we'd like to explain to you that uh, Sharon Elizabeth will generally take the lead on this, but I am doing this today and I brought my lovely Lamdoma and this beautiful crystal harp. And we are gonna have a sound experience with the Sophageo frequencies and especially 528. So we will have a sound experience and also be speaking of the names of God. So this will be more of a sound experience. I will go ahead and give you a lot of information about the different frequencies and why it's so important to bring those frequencies in to us at a physical, emotional, and spiritual level. I will request at the beginning of this to let you know that we do have a donation box um, here for the people that are here personally uh, to keep this beautiful ministry going. But the reason Sharon, Reverend Sharon Elizabeth is not with you right now is that we have something exciting. We, uh, the church is sponsoring a farmer's market here at the Meadows. And uh, it's here, right there in the parking lot. It'll be happening um, here every Sunday. And they're gonna have organic produce. And this will also be a wonderful way to bring in um, revenue for the church so that we can keep the light here, our beautiful flame alive and share wisdom. So uh, again, thank you for coming. And you are in really for a treat, but let me give you a little bit of information first as to what we're gonna be doing with the Sofeggio frequencies. And we have some wonderful people here. And we are gonna begin with a beautiful prayer. And I'm going to have, why don't we go ahead and have you read the Lord's Prayer right now. And this is our lovely assistant, Carol. And Annie, if you're here, we would love to have you sing um, the wonderful words of Jesus. So Annie uh, Ng is our another reverend. And so this is gonna be a really wonderful experience today. But Carol, would you like to come on and, and read? We'll start off with the, with the Lord's Prayer for everyone. Mm. So here are the Lord's Prayer. You know, here it is. Okay. Mm -hmm. The Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heavens, let thy name be sanctified. May the kingdom come. Let your will take place. As it is in the heavens, so also upon the earth. Give us today the bread for this day. Forgive us our sins, as we also have forgiven our debtors. And lead us not into the hands of temptation and deliver us from evil. Amen. 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 amen, amen and amen. amen. Beautiful. And Karen, would you like to read the prayer for paradise on earth? It's very lovely. And this was a beautiful prayer that was with the John Ray Fellowship. And you can find them. They have a beautiful uh, website up. But it's the J-O-H-R-E-I fellowship.org in Florida. So they can see you. Mm -hmm. Prayer for paradise on earth. Great God of light, we behold your plan unfolding, whereby all spiritual clouds are dispelled, impurity and error cleansed from the realms of spirit and matter. The age of light and joy is being born. Through your infinite compassion, misguided forces waken unto truth, and negative practices cease. While forces of light and hindered restore the world to peace. All of nature receives your loving influence and finds its rightful place. 
peaceful clouds move across brilliant skies and the fragrance of countless flowers floats upon the air. Abundant harvests glorify the earth, every corner filled with happy voices. Boundaries between countries vanish and ancient conflicts disappear as if in dreams. All people are united, encircled by your light and guided by your wisdom. Through service to humanity, all are blessed with health, peace, and prosperity. Great God of light, strengthen us with courage and wisdom to follow your will and realize paradise on earth. Beautiful. Thank you. So I'm just going to give you a little bit of the background on the sofeggio frequencies. And today we're going to be playing these same sofeggio frequencies so that you have a sound experience, but it's going to be magnified because I have the lambdoma and this lambdoma, uh, it's a very rare instrument, but it can take a frequency and it will multiply it and it will divide it so that you're hearing actually half tones, quarter tones, and fractal tones of that same frequency. So you're playing with the Pythagoras, it's a Pythagoras keyboard. It was invented by Barbara Hero. Very few of them um, here uh, in the world, but I happen to be blessed to have one and to share it with you. So you'll see, you'll be able to hear the 528, but the other sofeggio frequencies. And I wanted to explain where the sofeggio frequencies come from because everyone hears about these sofeggio frequencies but they don't know the genesis or the origin of it and the early church fathers knew about them and then they were lost for some time because a lot of the original hymns were written with the sofeggio frequencies and also with 432 not 444 they weren't keyed to that whole background on the difference between between 432 hertz and 440 hertz and so even there and i'll be playing this for you so you can hear the difference how your body is immersed in this how is it it experiences it and it is able to make it come and activate so where they're coming up with the sofeggio healing codes and there is nine of them and I want you to also see this, that each number, it's like, it's like the numbers, uh, God's numbering game. And I want to teach you something so that when you go back home, you'll be able to look at the sofeggio frequencies in a new way. Each frequency is actually three digits. So let's say the first one, and I'm going to tell you where they come from. I'm going to tell you what they are, and I'm going to tell you where they came from but I want you to have this in the back of your mind as to why there's nine. So each number, and you'll have one, seven, four. If you just play a permutation and bring the number around, you're going to have four, one, seven. Then you take the four and you bring that around. So that's why you're having three sets of these numbers. And so I'm going to show you that. So you'll see it a little bit better. Um, you're transposing the numbers. So I'm going to give you the numbers first, but then you're going to start to see that each is a set of numbers. The numbers have been pulled and transposed. So that's where you're going to get the, the Fibonacci. It's almost like a Fibonacci sequence, but it's three. So you're moving the numbers from front to back, and that's what's giving you the three. There's three sets of each one. That's what's giving you nine. So the first number is 174. The second number, and these are all in Hertz, 285. Then you have 396, and everyone's heard about the importance of 396, and I'll go into that uh, later in 369. Can you see the numbers? This is with um, Nicole Tesla. But the frequency of 396 has been known, and it liberates guilt and fear. And this is, think of the different frequencies in Hertz, but the next number is 417. That's known to undo situations and facilitate change. Now we get to the 528. That's known for transformation and miracles of DNA repair. And I will go into detail. There are, they've done this in Russia. Wonderful gentlemen, they did 
uh, experiments and they can show that when your blood is exposed to the frequency of 528, it actually repairs and rewraps. And that's something really interesting to know about. So you are gonna have a sound experience. You're gonna be bathed in this beautiful sound. And this to me is what God really truly wants us to do. We have ears, we were gifted with that. We have a body and we can experience physically, but also emotionally and spiritually. And F sharp, by the way, and we'll get into that later, has been known throughout um, thousands of years as one of the special frequencies that can help ascension. So the next one after 528 is 639 hertz. Then the next one is 741. The next one is 852. That's returning to spiritual order. That's what that will help. And the 963 hertz. So I want you to see, again, you're transposing the numbers. And that's what a lot of people won't teach you. You don't understand where these sophagio frequencies come from. I'll show you the genesis of them. But I'm going to show you that here with the nine frequencies, it's a transposing of the numbers. Three, nine, six, right? So then you just move the six to the front, six, three, nine. Do you see that? And that's the one that connects relationships. Then you move that forward. You see that? And then you get 963. So does, am I explaining it to you? You're taking the number and moving it. You have it on a line, 369. You take the nine and make it in the front. And that gives you the next sophagio frequency. Do you see that? And then you take another. That's why each frequency comes with three. And it's a transposition of those numbers. But now you have the nine frequencies, which I will be playing today on the Lambdoma. I now want to go into detail about where the Sophagio frequencies came from. It was found by Dr. Joseph Barber in the Bible. The location of the codes was in Numbers chapter 7, verses 12 through 83. So when you take the Bible and you open your book up to numbers, what he's starting to see, Pythagoras mathematics, is you reduce everything to single digits. And when he added the numbers up on the verses from 12 to 83, that's when he discovered that you have all these particular frequencies going over and over and over again. So that's where they're coming from, from the Bible, out of numbers. When you take in numbers, and that's your keynote, right? You go in numbers and you reduce mathematically to a Pythagorean system of mathematics. So I wanted to let you know that's where it's coming from. And I bought the Bible in case anyone wants to do this. I will show you afterwards where that's coming from. And you know how you do simple reduction in the Pythagoras you take. So what you're going to do is you take verse, a verse and a chapter, and you go one plus one plus one, whatever the numbers are, and then you reduce it. That's the Pythagoras mathematics. That's what's giving you the sophagio frequencies. Very interesting in that it's locked away in numbers. So these codes will reveal the six to nine uh, electromagnetic frequencies that have the power to change our lives and heal. So I want you to see that there's physics behind sound. And at the end, I will read, I was able to find a beautiful, the Essene gospel of peace that will even talk to you about the importance of sound. So to, to give you the name so that you can remember this and look it up yourself, the people that discovered that there's DNA repair was in Russia, and it's a Peter. I'm going to give you the spelling of his last name. Russian, you can look this up. G-A-R-I-A-E-V. And this was in the 1990s. And he was a biophysicist and a molecular biologist. And he discovered with his group that you can use sound to rewrite and heal damaged DNA. So when you start to experience this, experience this and hear the sounds, understand that it's affecting you at a molecular level. 
not just an emotional and spiritual level. So um, this is something that you can look up and you're now starting to see that a lot of people are using sound, sound baths, certain frequencies to heal certain organs of the body. And then I uh, will just show you the, co the codes now. And I want you to start to experience this, feel it, and then I'll come back in and do a little bit more. Does that make sense? So I'm gonna give you the difference in the, so the difference uh, sophageo frequencies so that you can hear them. Now, everything that I'm going to be playing from here is going to be just 528. So we're going to do the unconditional love since this is the, the service for the divine unconditional love, we were going to play 528 first for a few minutes. Just want you to sit back, feel the beautiful music on all levels. Know that 528 is a sophageo frequency and it will heal you on many different levels. If it can rewire, if it can rewire your DNA, it can help repair you on many different levels. So I'm gonna play you some chords on 528. This is the Sofeggio frequency, 528, unconditional love. Try to match that thought, which is a frequency, and feel unconditional love as I play the frequency of 528 so that you will hear, feel, no unconditional love from a physical frequency and match and align your thoughts, sending unconditional love out to those that you know, your family members, your friends, the countries and the world right now. Sending love out to all mankind.
let the sound come into you and activate the unconditional love. Feel the unconditional love and be blessed by it for you and all those that you love. And we can chant yod hey vod hey in the frequency, which is the name of God, which is very special. And just to let you know, the glyphs, the Hebrew glyphs of the yod hey vod hey when a rabbi went into the, the, the pyramid in Giza and they stretched uh, leather over the tomb, the sarcophagus, when you chant the, 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 the vowels and the words yod hey vod hey it will show and it will take sand particles or even like a spectrogram analysis, it will show the glyphs itself. So the sound yod hey vod hey when pronounced correctly will literally move matter into that glyph. So you have the yod hey vod hey that is the, the glyphs, the yod hey vod hey the, the Hebrew, which is a beautiful sacred language, they knew that that was the form that the sound, it moved, that sound moves that into that form. So when this is the name of God, Yod, Hey, Vod, Hey, it's very sacred. These are the glyphs right here. You can see it, Yod, Hey, Vod, Hey. And then you can see that the sound itself will move matter in the shape of that glyph. So as we experience the frequency of 528 and have our bodies touched by it with our minds, let's go ahead together and chant yod hey vod hey along when I play this. You're going to see it first. presence of our divine creator coming and touching you with that beautiful frequency of unconditional love. So what I'm going to do now, I want you to hear the tone because everything else that I played was both 528, but a multiple or a division of. So every note that I played was a mathematical frequency of 528. I am now going to shift to another frequency, but I want you to hear the pure tone of 528. So that's when the blood was exposed to that. That's when the DNA was repaired. That is the exact frequency, 528. Just let your body and your mind just kind of take that in. knowing that that is actually healing you at a DNA level. So now with this beautiful instrument, I'm gonna take you up the frequencies and let you hear the subfegio frequencies.
So right now, that is the frequency of 174. And now I'm going to expose you to that frequency, hear it. And now I will play all the different fractal frequencies of it. The next sophageo frequency is 396. That's a Hertz, and it is known to help liberate guilt and fear. And we absolutely have that need right now. So this is the next frequency. I want your bodies and your minds to be exposed to this. Receive that. And here I'm going to give you the frequency now of 396. That is the exact frequency, 396, helping you liberate guilt and fear. So as you feel this frequency, allow the beautiful blessing to come in and the fear and guilt to leave you, releasing fear and guilt. to hold on to any fear you are eternal your soul is divine release all that you need to release and only hold on to love The next frequency we're going to do is 417. This is 417 
and it is known to help you undo situations and to facilitate change. And during these times, we need that more than ever to help facilitate change in a good direction. So I'm going to let you hear and experience now. This is the frequency of 417. That is the frequency right there. So just let your body feel that. And as I start playing these frequencies of it, allow yourself to be open for change. And when you think upon change, remember that you need to be free of guilt and fear and open to all the new things from the blessings of God coming into your life. the beautiful sequence works as you're free of the guilt and fear you're an open vessel and now you can encompass and allow change into your life that can be absolutely amazing but you have to have a grateful and open heart for that you see and be free of all the obstacles so the next one and we've already played the 528 but i'm doing this in sequence the next one so you can hear it is the frequency of 528. And now can you see how this works chronologically, step by step? So now that we've released all the obstacles, all the guilt and fear, we're open vessel, then you're open to change. And now this is the 528 is the frequency of transformation because you've opened yourself up for change. And repair. The next frequency is 639, that's connecting relationships. This is the Sophagio frequency 639. And as you hear it, connect to those that you love. Reach out to them across the dimensions, across the universe, heart to heart. Connecting to your beloved. Mm -hmm. 
your family of light. This is the frequency of connection. to connect with yourself because you are a beloved child of God. The next one is going to be frequency 741. This is the fre so Feggio frequency to awaken intuition because we have divine gifts. Our intuition is one of them. And we need that in this beautiful world down here. So we need both our intelligence, but also intuition. And this is the frequency that opens that up. So this is the frequency 741. I'm gonna let you hear it just in its pure sense. Allow that to open up your third eye and all of your beautiful innate intuition. This is inner guidance given to us from our beautiful, wondrous God. The next Sofigio frequency is 852, 852. This is the returning to the spiritual order. So this is aligning everything up, having that beautiful path and allowing everything to be organized instead of chaotic. And this is in a spiritual manner, 852. So just as our planets were organized from chaos, we have a spiritual organization that also we are blessed with. Asafegio frequency is 963. And remember that it is intimately connected with 369. You see, that comes together. So 396, 963, they're all connected together in that same loop. So this is the frequency of 963.
Beautiful. So now everyone has been exposed to the beautiful frequencies, the nine sophageo frequencies. You've heard them and you've heard them play into your body, your mind, and your emotions. And what I'd like to do now, if Annie would be open, would you like to sing EIO? This is setting this up. We've been experiencing these beautiful frequencies. This is our lovely Reverend Annie Ng, and she has set to music these unutterable there. This is in a language that we know a little bit about the EAO, but it was in a language that Jesus uttered. And so she has set this to music, which is absolutely beautiful. It's not on, that's the, the but can you, you can play it here. Okay. And I'm going to give you the mic here. Oh, yeah, good. It's just for the Zoom audience. And this is sacred.
Annie, that was absolutely spectacular. Thank you for setting that to music. Those are the sacred words from Jesus the Christ in a language that most people don't remember anymore. So um, I would also like to explain a little bit and um, about Jesus. There's a mathematical frequency about him having a number, the early church fathers, gave Jesus a, a mathematical number. And I'd like to play that um, before we close everything up and you have a couple things to read too. But I wanted to let you know, just to alert you to the fact that the early church fathers had given Jesus the number of 3168. And it, uh, the Lord Jesus Christ, when you do it with Jamatra and you add it up, will add up to the numbers of 3168. But also, it's very interesting that Bethlehem in Palestine, the Ladnatudmo line, is very close to 3168. And they would have never known that back then. But the early church fathers did give him that. And so Bethlehem, Bethlehem in Palestine, the longitude and latitude lines are 3170, but 3520. It's very, very close, which is interesting. And so then you also will take the number, the base of the Pyramid of Giza, which is 72 when you multiply it by 11, gives us the number of 732, which is also a significant number. So um, Yahweh, the way you get to that number of 72 is you take the glyphs, the yod heh vod and they each have numbers in the, in the Hebrew tradition. And when you add that up, that gives you the number of 72. So I just wanted to kind of lightly touch on that. And at the end, I will actually play um, 3168. I can play actually 3168 on the Lemdoma. But that is the number associated with Jesus the Christ. And I think that's really Im important to know. So I wanted to let you, uh, to, to um, expose you to this. It's, the Epis uh, it's from the Essene Gospel of Peace. And... I can't, for the next lecture next month, I'll go into it a little bit more what the Essene Gospel of Peace, but they discovered it in the Vatican Library. And this is from the Essenes. And this is from Jesus's words. And he will talk to you and he answers questions, which I think is absolutely wonderful. But I'm running out of uh, a little bit of time here, but I do have it for those who wanna stay here, but we're supposed to make sure to close up around 1130 here. But this is Jesus in uh, speaking to his disciples, 
in the, the, the Essene Gospel of Peace. And you can look it up online. You can find this. And this is him speaking about the importance of sound. And when the sun is high in the heavens, then shall you seek the holy stream of sound. In the heat of noontide, all creatures are still and seek the shade. The angels of earthly mother are silent for a space. Then in it you shall let into your ears the holy stream of sound, for it can only be heard in the silence. Think on the streams that are born in the desert after a sudden storm, and the roaring sound of the waters as they rush past. Truly, this is the voice of God if you did not know it. For as it is written in the beginning was the sound, and the sound was with God, and the sound was God. I tell you truly, when we are born, we enter the world with the sound of God in our ears, even the singing of the vast chorus of the sky, and the holy chant of the stars in their fixed rounds. It is the holy stream of sound that traverses the vault of stars and crosses the endless kingdom of the heavenly father. It is ever in our ears, so we hear it not. Listen for it then in the silence of noontide. Bathe in it and let the rhythm of the music of God beat in your ears until you are one with the holy stream of sound. It was this sound which formed the earth and the world and brought forth the mountains and set the stars in their thrones of glory in the highest heavens. And you shall bathe in the stream of sound and the music of its waters shall flow over you. For in the beginning of the times, so did we all share in the holy stream of sound and gave birth to all creation. And the mighty roaring of the stream of sound will fill your whole body and you will tremble before its might. Then breathe deeply of the angel of air and become the sound itself that the holy stream of sound might carry you to the endless kingdom of the heavenly father. There where the rhythm of the world rises and falls. Isn't that beautiful? And that is in the Essene gospel of peace. And that is Christ telling you that nature, earth, all the stars emit this frequency and bathe in it. And there will be future instructions, and I will go ahead in more detail in the next sermon and give you more of this. But this is Jesus Christ's words. Isn't it beautiful? So what I'm going to do is have you read, um, you know, because we want the forgiveness prayer. We want to have that beautiful forgiveness prayer read. read. And um, if you can do that, I will set the Lamb Doma up while you read that. And I just want to play, and we will sit in just a beautiful silence, the frequency of Jesus Christ, 3168. And then I'll close. Would you like to get up and just read that beautiful? Because this is a beautiful, the one for um, uh, this, one. this one. This is the prayer of personal forgiveness. And this is forgiving yourself and all, everyone. And this is what we need to do so we can emit beautiful, pure love. Okay. All right. I bless this day and give thanks for my life. God, I am your child, your humble child. I give you my love and thank you for your constant love and blessing. God, I ask that you help me forgive and release completely and totally. All people who have hurt me through thought, word, or deed, knowing or not knowing, 
Please, God. Please, God. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. I ask that you help all people that I have hurt through thought, word, or deed, knowing or not knowing, to forgive and release me completely and totally. Please, God. Please, God. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. I ask that you help me forgive and release myself completely and totally for all the times I hurt myself or hurt others through thought, word, or deed, knowing or not knowing. Please, God. Please, God. Thank you. Thank you, God. Thank you, thank you, God. I ask that you help all life forms that I have hurt in any way, at any time, to forgive and release me completely and totally. Please, God, please, God. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. I ask that you help me to be forgiven and released completely and totally for all my hurts or wrongs to the earth and the life of the earth through thought, word, or deed, knowing or not knowing. Please, God. Please, God. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Thank you. With this release, freedom, peace, power, and new life. I bless all creation in the entire universe and fill the entire universe with my love. I love and bless the earth. All life and all humanity I love. Bless and respect the visible and the invisible. I rejoice and give thanks for my new life, power, health, and give complete blessings and love to all life always. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Thank you. Amen. That wasn't that beautiful. So now we're going to do the mathematical equivalent of 3168. This is the number, the mathematical, the, uh, the number that the church and with the Hebrew lettering that you get when you do the Lord Jesus Christ will add up to it. And even the circumference of the earth, the, the base pyramid of the Giza gives you that same frequency number, which is interesting. So uh, this is 3168. It's very high. So I'm going to bring this down. And that's, can you see that was a very high number, the frequency of Christ? We're bringing it down into an audible where we can hear it and not be so affected by it with our ears. And use this moment for silence as Jesus instructed. Karen, would you like to play the harp? Do we have it? Okay. 
we're going to close now. I'm going to let her play the harp. So you can hear this is crystalline music. And everything has a sound to it. And we're exposed to it. And for those of you, um, we invite you to come every Sunday to the Sunday service at 1030. We have uh, Sharon Elizabeth has a beautiful channeled um, meditation on Monday nights. We have Tai Chi, but we now are having this beautiful farmer's market. And if you so feel um, to have a love exchange of energy, we would really appreciate it. If you leave a love offering, you can go to our website, ccosl forward slash donate um, at ccosl.com forward slash donate and leave something for the church to continue its beautiful ministry. So we'll give you a few moments to hear the beautiful crystalline. And remember that God said, and he brought light. You say it, you think it, and you do it. And these same kinds of abilities he gave to us. When God said, let there be light, there was light. So as we think it, as we say it, and we have a body to do this, we can beautifully orchestrate that into our lives, sowing love and hope. So we're going to sign off for now. Thank you so much. If there's any questions, um, go ahead and feel free to put it in the chat box. This is our Zoom members. Beautiful. And I'm going to go ahead and sign off. And thank you so much for attending the session or the session here with the Cosmic Church of Spiritual Life.